Just say that I have been hype about this fucking movie since I fucking saw the preview. Look at the motherfucking suits. You better go, go, Power yeah, Ranger. I saw the but it wasn't long ago. It was the last movie that I saw. Let me tell you. Hmm. Sorry. I don't know, but obviously it wasn't that good because I don't remember. I, I want to say it was a uh, Suicide Squad, but it wasn't because I loved that and then no, it, I, didn't, I didn't see Power Rangers, unfortunately. I forgot when I saw it, but I, I saw it, it was, you know, pretty much. Well. As soon as I saw it, like, for the first time I saw it, bitch, I, when I was sitting in the theater, bitch, I felt like a little kid just came across motherfucking annihilator that got that to that perfect state of being squishy and subtle. I used to have this friend, right, just a little break off on that. I used to have this friend. I'm not gonna say the names, you know. Um, I used to have this friend, this uh, close friend, with sticking nailators in her bra. Like if we all went to the store and we got nailators, bitch, she would she would be like, give them to me, give them to me, bitch. And she would stick them in her titties, bitch, and let them sit, bitch. And then like 15 minutes later, bitch, bitch, the best fucking nailators you will ever have in your life, hands down. I'm not even playing. Yo, go find you a big titty bitch, honey. Right? And put your nail laters in her motherfucking bra. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And I know she probably had on a good bra too, honey. So because she had really big ones, big tits, you know, um, big pretty tits. They got them my motherfucking nail laters too, a motherfucking savory straight to perfection. It was so good, so good. Our tits and nail laters. How did we get there? So bad. Jesus. Um, yes, but it's like one of my favorite songs. You want to hear another snippet? perfect songs if you use like you know Saturdays for cleaning your entire house like a deep cleaning. I don't know how many of you grew up like like that but in my mother's house bitch Saturday bitch no schools all from the weekends um, no bitch you wasn't no seven day Adventist they went to school on Saturdays and all bitch I remember I had a friend that was seven day Adventist she went to school bitch didn't even graduate matter of fact flash forward 25 years later but she I ain't going to um, do that to her. But hey, girl, you know, but I'm, I'm just saying, isn't it ironic, though? No judgment. I'm just saying. You would um, think the the next fucking album, I mean, Bitch, Einstein is his last name, I mean, Or bitch, mm -hmm. Benjamin mm -hmm. Banneker, I mean, Benjamin Banneker, I mean, uh, Abraham mm -hmm. Lincoln. Motherfucking, maybe you fuck around and be um, Cicely Tyson. I mean, not that she created anything, <laughs> she was an actress, but. I was trying to get to fucking Madam um, C.J. Walker, but my mind went blank. There's no chairs and saw bitch. Her the king of mine. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so I expect it is just... Um, what the hell was I talking about? It's when you're like cleaning the crib, and you know, you, you might be off for that weekend, and maybe you just work later or whatever, but you're taking that designated time that Saturday. Saturday. Well, to be honest, I have that Tuesday Thursday, I can't, mm -hmm. Saturday, I, I can't, you know, and, 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 and it's no murder mystery that, you know, I'm this one, you know, I'm, you know, and, um, Ayala advised me to get a very small place. Yes, bitch, Ayala Van Zandt, when she came back, the last one, I she fixed me. my life. Yup. Yeah. She said, downsize, nigga. Downsize! You gotta go within! She said, Damn, Ayala. She spits. Nah, I'm playing. Ayala did not come in and. Yo, y'all know that it was a joke. <laughs> that was a TV moment. That was just. If you didn't catch that, you better go back and push slow. And yes, you know, I just spit fucking all that. All over me. Um, but yes, fucking. Um, yeah, so when you're cleaning. Play that song. 
wait till it's winter. winter time. We'll wait till it's like dead ass spring, like a beautiful spring night afternoon. Sun is high, literally is low. Temperature is up, bitch. Bitch, rain is zero precipitation, honey. And bitch, you just play that. And open up your balcony door if you have one, or your screen door, and your sliding door, or your um, doggy door, door, bitch. Whatever the fuck you open, open up, open, open up. that present. You gotta open up your box. No, hi, ballroom kids. Um, yes. All right. So, listen to me now. That song, and there's more. Like, you want to have a whole musical vibe, you know? But I don't know how much of the song I can play without um. YouTube coming in and fucking muting my whole fucking video or telling me that I can't monetize. Bitch, what? Delete. <laughs> Delete. Edit, 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 edit. There you go, YouTube. I took the music off. Fuck it, your way. Bitch, fuck that. Niggas trying to get paid. I don't give a fuck what you say. Listen. Hey, hey. Bitch, I've been, I've been trying to adapt for the longest time the, the authentic. Uh, mentality, which I don't, I don't work for free. Honey. I don't. Oh, because even though you I know. have many strides to still take in my endeavors, many strides, I ain't gonna hold you. I live in my reality all day, and I still love the mm-hmm. fuck out of me. That is superior to any other <laughs> touch in this life. So, Francesca. Okay. So, you know, and, um, bitch, listen. Oh, I've been watching Freaky and Grace. See, this is why I was getting confused and lost on what I was saying. I already don't know what I was about to say. Just carry on. So, but I've been watching Freaky and Frankie and Grace on Netflix. That show is fucking hilarious. Oh, my God. From the first episode, mind you, when it first came out, because I love me some motherfucking um, I don't know why I have this strange urge to say Tammy Faye. Um, because that was it. No. Usually. <laughs> but she Bridget had, Fonda. No, no, no. Jane Fonda. Was Bridget Fonda and Jane Fonda related? Mother, daughter, sisters, something at all? I don't know. Somebody answer that for me. I always wonder that. Because Bridget Fonda was the girl in motherfucking in the movie Single White Family. Mm-hmm. Bridget Fonda. Then you have Jane Fonda, who played in Monster in Law with the legendary workout videos from the 80s. Yeah, she was all types of pinup. She was sexy. And she still sexy. looks If she's the same age she is to playing in that show, Frank and Gracie, great, great, Grace and Frank. Frankie, <laughs> Frankie, bitch. I feel, do y'all remember those two little girls that was from uh, London that performed on um, Ellen? Ask Ellen. Ellen? Yeah. Oh, Ellen. Gracie. Gracie. Great scene that she had her height man. Oh, oh, oh. Which mind you, she grew up. Okay, y'all remember how she used to play that that that, that uh back back scene with the gangster league? No, nope, no, nope, now she's a whole lot of fucking shining star, bitch. Uh, I'm real game, not me, game, bitch, not yes, me. Bitch, you didn't know that that was her playing a star. That is her playing star. Say no, nah, I'm kidding. I'm joking. That's actually Honey Boo Boo. Yes, her mom lost weight and they got it together. I'm sorry, I'm black. Get into this I'm black and video. I'm gonna post her. And bitch, y'all can go ahead and sit and just come with my venture. Because I got a lot to motherfucking lay out on the line. You know, and that's why I like take breaks. You know, to where I'll post other content. But you you won't get me sitting here, you know, chatty Kathy me unless there's a special part of, like, the conversation. Are you working the converse? If you don't know what I'm talking about, then kick your ass back. Do not pass go. You watch that video first. It's a storyline here, people. Come on. Oh. Okay. So, like I said, take me back here. See, I just remembered it. It's about to come out right now. Shut up and make me forget. Um, no, I do that because I can so see uh, a viewer over there like, could you just come in and just say it? Like, yeah, it's interactive. Yeah. Okay. It ain't in real time, okay? I'm already calculating all this money for us. We about to win. We about to mix it. We have just, just too much money to even care, okay? You know what I'm saying? This is now when, when it's going on with you now, when it happened, but right now. Uh huh. Later. <laughs> yeah, I am a fucking man. I can't. I am. Listen, this is all good to be. I, I want you to tell me I really don't. 
you know, I learned a long time ago that you can't please not man every bitch with blood running through her motherfucking way and it's beating heart, honey. Nope, you sure can't. That bleeding heart, Sally struggles look. Bleeding mm-hmm. heart. And I ain't talking about Leona Lewis. Keep bleeding, keep, keep bleeding in love. You only had one hit. She- Hello? She's a very pretty girl, though. Whatever happened to her? She never got her moment. Girl get into it. Leona Lewis never got her. Y'all need to go sleep. That girl was Bitch, that's the bullshit. Bitch, that's it. She was one of the, the, the overlooked gems. She just got her nose job a little bit too late. And they fired her stylist a month after they should have hired him at all. And, um, and whatever. I think she's on like X Factor. Australia or Abu Dhabi or one of those foreign bitch unless it ain't bitch it ain't listen X Factor UK X X Factor America if they still have it I don't even follow those shows specifically but X Factor UK X Factor uh, America are the shit okay those are the only ones that I'm fine tuning with when it comes to X Factor which I am not thinking about X Factor Brazil or Korea or, or Norway Bitch, you remember how Top Model had all the Top Model Bra- Brazil? What? Top Model Korea. Top Model India. Bitch, what the hell is a sorry? I know what a sorry is. Word up. Shout out to my motherfucker. See, 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 see. I almost made a comment there. See, this is a big thing for me because I often forget very I ignorantly say Indians, okay? Um, when it comes to. And I'm, I'm not talking about Indians from India. I'm talking about Indians as far as Native Americans, you know, the natives to this land. I don't give a damn what your racist uncle told you here first. They were, you killed them, Ireland. Sit your ass back. So, I don't know. I'm just talking shit. Bear with me. I got a point here. Okay? So, I have a habit of calling them Indians. The Native Americans. I don't just call Indians from India Indians, okay? But those are the Indians. The the the, the Indians that comes out of this motherfucking trap. Yo, trout mouth heathen um, is not a term that should be used. So if you are there and you're like me, let's try to do better because you don't want to be afraid of the natives. You honey, you don't want to do that. And this is about the speech as well. So I'm going to clear off some space, and I'm coming back, which I ain't done. I'm going to change, I'm going to put Francisco back in his box, bitch, and maybe switch out John Wayne Jr., bitch. Huh? Add the Wayne, drop the Gacy. You killing these whole time. <laughs> yeah, I think that's right. This shit always good on me, bitch. Just the recycle bin, I got to empty it. Fuck. Oh. 